Microsoft.NET Framework 1.1 Installation Guide In this installation, we are going to install Microsoft.NET Framework 1.1. We also will execute two commands using command prompt. You may find the command in the installation guide PDF file. Let's start the installation. Run your installation CD. Right click and select open. In the installation CD, you may find several files for Xportal 2005 installation. For this video, we will need to open Microsoft.NET Framework 1.1 folder only. Right click and select open. In this folder, you may find several files for .NET installation. For this steps, you need to open the installation guide PDF file. Right click and open the installation guide. In this installation guide, you may find several options to install the .NET Framework 1.1. For this video, we will use option 4, as it is applicable to most of Windows platform. You also can find several command that we will use later. Now you may minimize the PDF file first. Next step, we are going to create new folder in C drive. Open your C drive. Now you create a new folder, and named it as .NET. Next step, open the Microsoft.NET Framework 1.1 folder, and then you copy selected files. Now you open the .NET folder that you just created, and then paste the selected files. Next step, we are going to open command prompt window. You need to run it as administrator. Next step, you are going to execute command prompt. Now you open back your installation guide to copy the command. Copy command step number 5. Minimize the PDF file. On command prompt window, paste step number 5 command, and then press enter. Now you copy command step number 7.
paste command step number 7, and then press enter. After you execute your second command, make sure you see this message before you start your installation. Now click yes to start the installation. If you see this program compatibility issues, just run the program. You can see the files are extracted in .NET folder. Wait until you see installation completed message. All right, now we have completed the Microsoft.NET Framework 1.1 installation. Let's start the second installation. Click OK to finish your installation. In this installation, we are going to install the service pack and execute two more commands prompt. Let's start the installation. Now you open back the installation guide file to copy the command. Copy command step number 10. Now you paste command step number 10 and then press enter. You can see the file is extracted in .NET folder. Now we are going to copy the last command. Copy command step number 12. Now you paste command step number 12 and then press enter. If you see this program compatibility issues, just run the program. Please wait for the setup to complete and disappear automatically. Now we are going to perform the last step. Open your .NET folder. Then double click on NetFX file. If you see this program compatibility issues, just run the program. Please wait until the configuration completed. Now you open back your installation guide file, and go to step 16. Then open back your command prompt window. Alright, let's check together. The final display of your command prompt window, should be the same with the one, shown in the installation guide. Now you have completed the second installation. Well that's it for this installation guide. We would love to hear your feedback about this video. Let us know. At microengine.net slash support. You also may find us on Facebook, YouTube and Google+. Thanks for watching.